information from Malaysia and Thailand for a collaborative project. Well, so thank you, Titia, for the wonderful uh, presentation. And uh, the presentation um, on the mushroom poisoning in Thailand is quite a large amount compared to the unrecorded cases from Malaysia as well. So today we are going to talk about this Chindawan Baratchun in Malay, we call mushroom, uh, in English we call mushroom poisoning of course. So in Malaysia we need to know and update those information as in Thailand as well. So now uh, we are the taxonomies or mycologists, we are gathering all this information to disseminate the knowledge to public, okay, uh, occurring in Southeast Asian cases. Huh? So today I would like to talk about on this uh, Chitawan Baratun or mushroom poisoning in Malaysia in terms of the peninsula Malaysia and some stories about the Abonian side as well. So we have started, um, you know, uh, the research here since 2010 by collecting uh, mushrooms for many purposes, okay, uh, whether it's for chemical analysis, whether it's for... Uh, sorry, Dr. Jeff, can you just share the screen in the... Okay, thank you. Okay. Can you all see now? Okay. Okay, so as for the introduction, I'm going to talk about uh, what is uh, mushroom poisoning is considered about. And uh, secondly, problems and challenges. Definitely, we need to identify the problems. Uh, what are the problems and the challenges uh, that, you know, in uh, identifying these uh, poisonous mushrooms. And some of the very uh, little bit of knowledge on the identification technique and some species information will be provided and uh, will, will be based on the case studies of in uh, especially in Malaysia and uh, what are the awareness to public or medical doctors or health inspectors that can be given by a mycology. So we will discuss this a little bit because Dr. Pan will be talking about the awareness all these uh, into the medical sector. Sir. Okay, then, then we are going to talk about the collaborative efforts and mitigations in 